this video, we will explore the making of this amazing promotional, fashion-related animation for Instagram. Very briefly, I will show you how we have created this template and why Artboard Studio is a lot better and faster than After Effects or other motion design tools. Let's have a look at the project in Artboard Studio and discover the content, keyframes and the structure of this animation. First, we have found these amazing stock videos from Pexels and downloaded HD versions of them. Imported these videos by just dragging and dropping into the canvas. Organized the layers panel and named each layer. Started with the first footage, three women walking and, at the end, there is one woman away. We thought that zooming to this woman's face and bringing the circle text on this part is a good idea. Then, there was a perfect moment, that woman was looking to left side. That was the perfect time for bringing the second sequence to the scene. But while moving the first video to the right, we moved the circle text at the same time to create a parallax effect. Also, we have added a border radius and stroke to this video. With Artboard Studio, it is so easy to edit these kind of effects to your video. You can change the stroke or color options as you want, without waiting for any preview render time. Probably, you realize that the colors are different from the original video. We simply added a color overlay as a smart object layer and applied a solid color. But making this a smart object will also help to change this color filter instantly. Finally, the end stage, call to action part. Here we have added simple text layers and position keyframes to text layers. Let's unmask the content in the artboard and see the text layers outside. Making this animation was so fun and easy. Especially after working with After Effects for years and spending hours to make similar animations. With the same FPS was a dream. Now, a browser-based app giving you all capabilities and real-time previews even with HD videos. And check out these render benchmarks to see how long the render takes. With only using a Google Chrome browser, without downloading or working with any bloated softwares.